You're hitting it so relatively hard and it's... Ah! It is ah! <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm freaking out. This is a bronze axe, this is an elm tree, and very shortly I will have a pair of tongs. Primitive forging with no metal tongs. Another pair of tongs. I have to work to get them to fit onto the blade, but I kind of want them to spring closed like that. That's a handy thing. I can continue providing moral support. I need a fair amount of moral support, so thank you. Uh, well, that bloom that you've got over there, that chunk of bloom is looking pretty decent, so... Awesome. So there's some moral support. That looks beautiful. I have never... I... <laughs> I want to cry. It's so beautiful. At some point, that could be a problem. <laughs> <laughs> At some point. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> We're going to try to layer a bunch of these pancakes together to make the actual thing. Uh, it's not amazing, but it's workable. Yep, that's the color, that's the color. And then the Japanese smiths that I've seen make samurai swords, what they'll do is they'll layer these on top of a metal spatula, and they'll end up welding them to the spatula when they put it in the fire. That option I don't want to do because I don't want to introduce foreign metal, I'd like to do this pure. Yeah. But that means that I don't know how to layer those stacks. There's got to be a way to do it. Have we ever made a bloom and consolidated it in the same day? No. I don't think we have, have we? This is the first. I think I see yellow in there, but it's hard to tell. Okay. I think, I think I've got yellow in there. I think we're good? Yep. All right, fan off. Oh. Turn the fire off. Turn the fire off. Come here. Come here, little blue. Come here, 
Yeah. Not gonna hurt you. Just gonna shoot it up. That's what it's really good. There you go. Come on, Rock. Oh, Rock. Oh. <laughs> That's a beautiful thing right there. Oh, that is a beautiful thing. I'm dying, man. Oh, look, you're hitting it. You're hitting it so relatively hard, and it's ah. There is a ah! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm freaking out because that 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 behaves exactly how iron behaves. That's that's it. These two pieces layered on top of each other in the forge. We're now going to layer charcoal gently on top. I'm going to fire it back up. And ideally, we will find those same two pieces and forge well done together. If we can do that, then we can do this entire process with some time and patience using the primitive method. Go for it. Let's turn on the fan. And they're fused! Looks like it welded! <laughs> oh my gosh. We just did a successful forge weld. So now we've not only forge. taken the bloom pieces and consolidated them, we've actually forge welded them together. Yeah. We've got a small ingot. We have a small ingot. We have done a small ingot. Should we try for a second layer? That slag that just shot out. When they say that you pound out impurities, you literally pound out <laughs> impurities. Back in the forge in a minute. 